Hey everyone. Um, so, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. This is a brand new installation of Linux Mint on bare metal. I'm just gonna go ahead and close the welcome. Don't really need it. Um, so, first things that we want to do here. Everyone says update the system, but first thing that I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go to the driver manager. I'm just gonna make sure there's no drivers that I actually need. While I get that ready, I'm gonna do, let's go ahead and do that. Oops. There we go. Yeah, it helps uh, a lot more when you put in the right password. But yeah, I'm using a NVIDIA RTX 3080 as you can see here. While that gets is getting ready, um, since this is kind of like a first step slash rising video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to nano r bash rc. Let's just go ahead and get this thing ready. This isn't going to do anything right now, but it will in a bit. So let's go ahead and alias update. So uh, what this is going to do is, actually, let me just write out the command, and then you guys will kind of just get what it does in a sec. All right, so there's that command. Let me go ahead and make this a little bit bigger. So uh, essentially what this is doing is it's saying, instead of typing out all of these commands, we're just gonna put this alias. And so every time we just put update Z, it's gonna do all of this jargon before we do that. Um, I still haven't installed the package, um, but let's put it here anyway. Figlet. Let's go with, uh, actually, since my host, since my, uh, my user is called Rick Astley, let's, let's do never gonna, actually, I don't mind if this isn't, doesn't have space, gonna give, and let's pipe that into lolcat. Then an obligatory neo fetch oh, cat. All right, so uh, this will make sense later. Uh, so we need to restart. That's fine. I'm not going to do that quite yet. So let's control X to save this. Entire bash RC. Now, uh, let's. Uh, Let's do a regular sudo apt update. And a sudo apt upgrade. You might be wondering why I didn't just like put the update Z. The reason for that is because I'm still using the same terminal window. So if I wanted to use that config now, I would put source dot bash RC, but I'm not doing that. Um, because I still haven't installed Figlet, I haven't installed um, NeoFetch. So for now, I'm just going to do this. I guess while we wait for that, let's go ahead and do some stuff that I'm for sure going to do. I for sure want the panel up there. I, I've never liked the panel down there. Not sure why, just not my thing. I'm going to open up my panel settings. I'm going to make this a little smaller actually a lot smaller. Don't like how massive the panel is. Eh. Maybe a little more. 
sure. Yeah, that. Yeah. Let's go with that. Let's configure this. Let's change you. All right, let's see. Yeah, that one's pretty cool. Oh, actually, that one's kind of cool, too. Well, I'll go with this one. We'll just do this. All right. Let's make this a little smaller. I don't think there's anything that I want to do here, so let's go ahead and close that. All right, and that's finished. So one last thing that I'm going to do before I leave here is check our firewall. Actually, let's just enable this thing. Cool. All right, so let's do... Let's go ahead and define... Fault deny, and there's one more thing. Actually, two more things that I'm going to do before we reboot here. Uh, do I have Vim? I don't think I have Vim. Let's just use Nano. Let's go to Etsy default. Oh, gosh. I forgot the name of the file. Okay, I found the directory I was supposed to be in. Okay, that took a while. So let's ls, all right, so before rules, let's go ahead and sudo nano before dot rules. There we go, ICMP. So I'm just gonna go ahead and Let's go ahead and save that, and I'm going to go ahead and reboot, and after I do, we'll, uh, we'll do a little bit more ricing. Actually, no, wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Before we do, let's just go ahead and install some stuff. sudo apt install vim neofetch. Uh, what else are we installing? Figlet. For now, I think I'm going to just leave it at that, and then after we reboot, then we'll install a bunch more stuff. Okay, and looks like we're done, so let's exit. And yeah, I'm going to reboot. I'll be right back.